Hey guys, good afternoon. Thanks for, for joining. Uh, my name is Diogo. I, uh, I'm from Portugal. I'm the founder and CEO of Haven Digital Partners. Uh, I'm going to present to you today what we do at Haven, what's our goal, our mission uh, towards uh, Filecoin. Um, so Haven is a digital asset manager uh, focused on uh, institutional uh, token holders. And our goal is to source Filecoin tokens and uh, deploy to uh, Filecoin storage providers. Uh, so this is our team. So it's me, I'm Diogo, uh, as I said, founder and uh, CEO. I have a traditional financial background. I've worked in uh, banks, investment banks, uh, private equity. Uh, we have David Diaz as our key advisor and Asaf. So David Diaz, uh, you probably know him, is, um, is, uh, is from uh, the leadership team that founded and launched Filecoin in 2020. Uh, he's the author of Live Peer-to-Peer -peer and uh, IPFS for browser. And Asaf, our other key advisor, is was the, uh, the head of risk at Anchorage Digital uh, by, uh, by the time that Anchorage used to uh, do uh, the Filecoin lending uh, operation. Uh, so our partners, we are custodied by Anchorage Digital. So basically, I will show you in, uh, in some minutes how it, like everything works in terms of the token delegation, but we do it through the Anchorage uh, custody platform. We've been invested by Protocol Labs and we've been incubated and also invested by Lightshift, which is a, a Web3 um, venture capital. Okay, so as I said, Haven, our mission is to offer uh, uh, reliable returns for institutional token holders and uh, at the same time that we offer accessibility and predictability for the uh, storage providers to get access to the field tokens that they need to grow their business. How does it work for a storage provider? How, can, uh, how um, what can Haven do for a storage provider? Uh, it's basically offering a predictable and significant token liquidity. So that's the most important one is liquidity uh, because we are able to source uh, uh, substantial, substantial amounts of Falcon tokens from institutional holders. We offer predictability. So each deal is made specifically with each storage provider and we offer efficiency uh, we, we have been investing a lot of time uh, understanding the economics of Falcon. We have a forecasting model. Uh, we know um, everything about economics on Falcon, so we ask for a very minimal capital um, contribution, which is uh, an initial 5%. Um, and then we also do a, um, a revenue share model. For institutional holders, uh, what we offer is a tailor-made service. Basically, each institutional holder can choose uh, the storage providers they want to back. They can design their own portfolio. Uh, it's very transparent, so they get to know exactly what are the storage providers that they're backing and they're delegating the tokens to, and they get to choose the ones that they want. And it's secure because we are using uh, the Anchorage custody platform to, 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 to custody the owner address, basically. In practical terms, so um, how does Haven work for a, for a storage provider, right? So step by step. So first step is obviously the onboarding to our platform. We start with a, a due diligence process to understand, like we ask financial operational uh, questions, basically to understand how you guys, uh, how, how a storage provider run their business. We do some KYC and ML validation because again, we are a regulated investment manager. We have to do it. Uh, and then we sign the legal agreement, we uh, update term sheets, and then the, the, like the last onboarding phase is the platform registration. Uh, here is just like a, a screenshot of how does it look for a storage provider. So basically you can track all the other nodes that you have under our uh, under Aven. Uh, basically it refreshes every, every tip set. Then the second one, second part of course, is the, uh, the Filecoin token disbursement. Uh, as I said, the owner address is custody by Anchorage. We transfer 95% of the, of the agreed amount, and then the storage provider sends the 5% directly to the actor address. And these 5% are basically uh, pledged, and the QEP increases, the block rewards increases for everybody. So this is where we bring efficiency to the table. Um, third part, rewards. So the most important part, obviously. Uh, we do a revenue share. Uh, program, so it's a 50-50 revenue share. We take our performance fee out of the 50% of the institutional holders. 
And then the distribution, uh, this is where uh, basically I, I will spend some, some time here explaining what's the SP balance at the storage provider balance and the storage provider minimum balance. And uh, we've been searching a lot on Filecoin economics to basically to build up what we call the SP minimum balance. So basically we know at every second and every tip set, how much does it cost to terminate sectors? How much does it cost fault fee, invalid proof fee? So we know the um, um, what's the risk basically of a storage provider operation. And we ask that the storage provider has a balance in the actor address that covers the SP minimum balance. Every time it's higher, uh, the rewards are distributed. So the SP balance, uh, uh, usually, it's usually called collateral. We call it SP balance because it's really a balance. It's not a collateral. Uh, it, it is 5% uh, initial contribution. And then, uh, which is basically, it, goes, it covers the risk. Because on, on the graph uh, up, you have the risk. On the graph uh, below, you have uh, the SP balance. So basically, it's the initial contribution plus the reserve rewards that are locked. They basically work as, uh, as collateral. Uh, so very fast, um, how does this work for an institutional order, right? Uh, so the onboarding goes pretty much the same way as for a storage provider. We do KYC and ML validation. We sign the legal agreement, also the platform registration. Here is a print screen how uh, it looks for, uh, for an investor. Um, right now, uh, we're just doing Filecoin, but our goal is to expand into more, into more the pins. Uh, and offer uh, the staking service for more for more uh, networks. Um, second step is portfolio design, right? So basically, uh, as I said, this is a very tailor-made um, service. Each institutional gets to choose the deals and the storage providers they want to delegate their tokens to. It's very transparent. So basically what we do is we do what we call uh, the storage provider institutional report. After we conduct the due diligence, the KYC, we build a report about the storage provider operation. We present to the, to, the, to, to the institutional token holders and they get to choose if they want to delegate their tokens or not, how much they want to do it. Uh, and uh, of course, in a very secure way, as I told you, uh, we use the Anchorage uh, platform, uh, custody platform. Then the third part is portfolio monitoring, right? So once the portfolio is built, once the, uh, they choose the, the, the institutional holder, chooses the storage providers they want to back, they, they can track the, 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 all the, the nodes, all the actors, all the actor addresses in their uh, dashboard in our website. Uh, they, can, they can track the amount they delegated per storage provider, um, how much reward, um, how many block rewards the, the SPs are getting, what's the risk coverage, uh, what's the percentage of the uh, data is being onboarded as field plus, for example. And then the distribution works uh, pretty much the same way. Uh, this slide is the same as for the storage provider. So basically it's a 50-50 revenue share. And again, uh, Haven's performance fee is from the 50% of the institutional um, older um, share. So yeah, this is what I had uh, to present you guys today. Uh, I think we have some time for questions. If you guys have uh, any question, I'll be around uh, anyway if you guys want to ask anything or um, if you guys want to know more about the models that we built, the, the tracking uh, the tracking models that we have, uh, we basically monitor uh, every tip set, every, um, we, we know how much does it cost to, you know, to run the, the SP operation. We have uh, a Filecoin model, ec um, economics uh, model that basically we can forecast everything. So if you guys have, uh, um, want to help with that, or if you guys are in need of tokens, uh, just let me know and we can, uh, we can discuss further. Thank you.